Hello everyone, welcome to today's video. In today's video, we are going to be testing out that Fiona Styles matte finish um, foundation concentrate that I got for 75% off. Um, and we are, now you know I had to get a darker shade than I am. So we're going to be adding in the NYX Mixer, Pro Foundation Mixer in white. And I'm going to go ahead and put on my Algenist Anti-Aging Pore Correcting Primer before, and then that way it can be settling in while we mix up our um, foundation. I really don't like buying foundation that I have to mix because, well, you just never know if you're going to mix it the same every time. Okay, and that can settle in while we work on our mixing our foundation. So I am going to put, I have my little palette here, and I'm going to put one, two, that's probably enough. Two pumps, which is probably about a dime size. I probably should put a little, one more pump. I'd rather have too much. So I put three pumps and that's definitely probably a nickel size now. And then I'm going to put about the same amount of the white mixer in it. I'll show you. Try to put it. Ooh. That comes out a lot faster than the pump. And then I will mix that up with my handy dandy mixer. Still a little dark. I'm going to add a little more white to it. It was still a little dark. I have been tanning, but not that much. Not tanning. I've been using self tanner. That's tanning, huh? All right, we're going to go with this. Hopefully it's good. I'm just going to go ahead and wipe this on my face. No need to waste it. And then I'm just going to take this on my finger. Probably mixed way too much. Then I'm going to take my round RT stoop brush and spread it around. Um, now Everything Fiona Styles is on sale at Ulta because she was exclusively, I think, at Ulta. And I don't know what she's going to do. I don't know. I know she's not going to be with Ulta anymore, but I don't know if she's going to keep the whole range, the same stuff. I hope so now that I've tried it. Well, actually, I haven't tried it. I'm trying it now, but I tried the eyeshadow the other day and it was nice. This does not have high coverage because I can still see dark spots. So I'm going to go in with a second coat.
Maybe I will just stipple this on and then go in with a sponge. That sounds like a good idea. Although the sponge does take some off, doesn't it? Now I'm going to go in with my Bobbi Brown um, or on top of my eyes and then my shape tape. I'm just that out. This sample lasted a good long time when you only use it in a couple places, huh? Now we will go in with the Tarte Shape Tape. We're just gonna put this below the bags, brighten up around here, get rid of some of the red. I always have darkness in this corner out here too, so. I like to brighten that up. And of course, the inner corner always needs brightness. We will go in with my Laura Mercier brightening powder. I will use this little Eco Tool sponge. Into. I'm going to go back in with my oh, shape tape on my nose for a little bit of highlight. Then I'm going to go in with my Laura Mercier translucent powder. And just get some on my fluffy brush. And I'm going to, I just put a tiny bit in here and I'm just going to push it into my brush, shake it off a little bit, and then do the rest of my face and brush off that. It doesn't need to sit there for that very long. Okay, I'm going to go finish the rest of my makeup and then I will come back and show you the finish and then we will check in throughout the day. So I will be back.
Hello everyone, welcome back. I uh, forgot to come back right afterwards. I have, it's been a few hours. Um, it's so super hot today. I am going, this is gonna be my final check-in too because I don't know how long I'm gonna leave this makeup on. It's a holiday and it's hot and I already know that I do love the foundation. It looks good. Even though I'm sweating like crazy, it is a little shiny right now. But that's because I'm sweating like crazy. Maybe if I took a little powder to it. Oh, let's powder it a little. I actually was sitting here waiting to stop sweating to be able to do this. It's another reason I'm not gonna keep it on that long. But I do like it. I think it'll be great. I'm not sure how good it is in the heat. I'm not sure how good anything is in the heat though. But I have had it on for probably five hours because I forgot to come back and I like it and so this is going to be the final look for this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you will want to try it especially since it's 75% off and they have a not matte finish too just a, a luminous finish um, and they actually had more colors left of that so you better hurry though because it's 75% off and this is not a sponsored video or anything like that. And I hope she continues to make it. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I will see you in my next video.